Oh, you know you're in good hands when the hotel you're staying at has their big neon sign flickering like that. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, how's it going? The name's Lucris, and welcome to Devotion, an indie's horror game, and to be more specific, is actually the alpha demo version of it. So I'm not exactly sure how far along they are in the, its development, if it's finished, or if it can, you know, kind of just cuts halfway into it. But we're sure as heck going to find out, aren't we? My dear, come to our old hotel tonight. I'll be waiting for you. William H. June 19th, 2016. Why would I just accept going to a probably old run-down hotel because a letter told me so? That is brilliant! Well, first of all, things look pretty good considering it's an alpha demo version of it. I think the graphics look pretty darn good. Salvation. That away. Okay. Okay. Alright, so just based on that little bit of information and the fact of seeing all this stuff around, I'm guessing I'm going to a cult. I mean, I don't know, maybe it's not, maybe it's just, you know, a nice little gathering of people. Yeah, I might be wrong, I could be wrong. But seeing as how this is a, a horror game, I might not be wrong. Okay, we are, okay, I wonder who's calling me, why, why for what reason would I call, hello? Hey, what's up? Oh, hey Jeff, how you doing? I don't think I will, I probably have a lot of screaming, dying, and horrifying to do. Received a letter today from my dad. Oh, so that's who I got the letter from. Wait, I'm a girl again? Again? Seriously? Same as dead. I think the universe is trying to tell me something here. You're gonna have to let go sooner or later. The letter asked me to head to the old hotel of the family in the woods. Of, oh, so this is my hotel. This is my hotel. More than likely. How? How have I made any enemies? I've... I mean, how could I have made any enemies if I'm just trying to find my dad? How the heck could I have made any enemies at all? Let's hope that's not literally. Okay, well, I got my friend coming. Well, uh, well, we are already here. Got some lights on, so apparently this place is still running. Maybe, I don't know. Oh, well, might as well check and see the old place. Locked. Well, too bad I don't have a key. Kind of wish I did. But at the same time, I kind of wish I did. I'm kind of glad I don't. Maybe I can just leave. Can I just leave? I'd rather leave before the whole scaring starts. So if this hotel is in my family, does... Why is it run down? I mean, I'm seeing a lot of boarded up windows. So I'm guessing that it's not the, in the best of, uh... It's not in the best of straights. So, did something happen? And there are bars on the windows, too! That's... Perfect. Because nothing says... Family love more than bars on your windows. Here I am. Home sweet home. I just wish I could go back to a happier time. I do too, preferably before this night. Oh, I hope that's like ketchup or something. Alright, creepy hallway. That's perfect. Oh, a little map. Ooh, interact with the map. I could definitely use this. Oh. Okay, cool. All right, so I have no clue where I am, so I'm gonna have to take a look. See, let's check out these rooms first. Maybe I can figure out where I am at that point. Dad. Dad. Who? Is Daddy there? Where's Daddy? I got a few words to say to Daddy. Where did that creaking come from? Oh, you gotta love the artistry. It's nice, at the very least, gives you something to look at. With all the... Ooh, is that a Midsummer's Night Dream, maybe? Ooh. Not sure what all these paintings are for, but, um... I don't know if I like the symbolism all that much. More bars! That's, that's perfect. That's perfect. Alright, so we're stuck here, so 214. This is the only door I haven't tried yet, so let's go... Oh! That was a rather loud door. Don't like that, but okay. And more artistry. You gotta love the artwork. Alright, let's see more of the symbols here. 
So I'm guessing that was the symbol of the 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 thing. I'm not sure what I, I'm not calling it a cult just yet. Ahem. I am reborn. While wandering aimlessly through life, looking for some meaning, Mr. Hawksworth has come to see me, come to me, and given me a reason to believe better days are to come. He brought me to this place, and it. He brought. Let's try that again. Jonathan Capiro, age 20, Las Vegas, Nevada, weekly report number one, date 12 10 2012. I am reborn. While wandering aimlessly through life, looking for some meaning, Mr. Hawksworth has come to me and given me a reason to believe better days are to come. He brought me to this place. It was once a hotel, but now it houses my hopes for a better future. He gave us these sheets so that we can write our thoughts each week. He didn't tell us why, but he doesn't have to. He claims that as long as we follow his steps and never leave the safety of this church, we will ascend to paradise once our earthly stories come to an end. I chose to follow him and enter his church. Oh, dear gosh. So apparently, Daddy Dearest decided he's in charge of a church now. Oh, we're interacting. Eesh. Nope. Not sure if that's a good or bad thing. I've seen dozens of movies where that can be a horrible thing. Ooh, lovely. A key. Hall key. Okay, I know exactly where to go for this guy. Let's just hope that Daddy Dearest had the best of intentions when making this, um... Faction of a church. This, uh, this, co this community. Let's call it a community. That's nice. It's a nicer sounding name. Okay, now, do I want to go into the hall? That's the bigger question. Seeing as how I'm trapped either way, might as well. Oh, I don't like it when things are covered, draped over, stuff like that. That all, that never, that never seems to be a good thing. That never seems to be a good thing when they're just draped over, stuff like that. It's ticking, but it's stuck at 302. Okay. Oh, man, who set all this up? It's like they intentionally thought that, hey, you know what would be a great idea? Let's make this into a little maze. I'm sure whoever gets into it, now, now follow me on this, whoever comes into this hotel is going to be like, hey, we're in a maze, like a maze. It's like one big carnival ride. All right, let's see where we're, uh, welcome back. What am I being welcome back to? And did I? <laughs> a father. Is that daddy dearest? Isn't that why you're here? How, how or is that you? someone else? Because I'm not sure. Well, that isn't creepy. How do you know everything about me? And I know nothing about you. He was a great conversationalist. Ow, face. Stop it with the creaky doors. It doesn't help matters at all. And I can't go to the stairs. So apparently I can't go to the tippy top right now. That's great. No, oh, no. Don't trust him. Well, what him are we talking about? Are we talking about Daddy Dearest, or are we talking about the guy who I just saw on the TV? Oh. Again, here we start with the music. She is coming for us. Who's the she? And why am I hearing music? Oh. Oh, a hiding place! Great, that means, oh, there's gonna be some hiding in this game, isn't there? That I'm gonna have to be hiding from something. There's never a hiding spot available, unless they got... Unless you need to hide. Oh, dear gosh. Oh, well, that doesn't paint a pretty picture. Yeah, let's turn it off. This is creepy enough as is. Alright. Okay, that's fine, but we should probably get out because... Oh! Why the red light? I'm pretty sure I- Oh my god, is anyone here? I don't know, but I don't like the fact- Oh gosh. 205, okay, that's fine, that's fine. That is- that is all right! I must call Jeff. Yeah, that'd be nice. Maybe he can get us out of here. Jeff, I'm in the hotel. There's something wrong. Yeah, no duh! Well, nothing yet, but I'm locked in here, and I have some creepy music blast into my ear. And there's a really creepy guy saying, like, uh, something about welcoming me back here. I'm not leaving. Why not? Whoever sent that letter knows about my dad. I will get to the bottom of this. If you didn't want my help... Why did you call me? 
Uh, for hope, maybe you can, hoping that maybe you can talk me out of staying here, maybe I can just leave. I can just leave right now, there's literally nothing keeping me from leaving! Yes, bring that, and bring a whole army with you, in fact. Uh, you know what? I, I, I know I'm a stubborn girl, I know that, I accept it, I like being a stubborn girl, but, honestly, there's, there's stubborn and there's... Okay, this is 205, yes? Yes. All right. Uh, shut that. Don't want that thing getting in. Okay. Oh, code. 84925. What's that for? Is that the... I, I, there's nothing... Why do I need a code for? Here's where we want to go. We can't get there because we can't interact with the doors. And there's nothing there that I can use the code for, so I don't think I can use the code for that. Well, the only place I can logically think to go next is probably storage A. There might be something there I can get and hopefully get out of this nightmare. Oh, perfect! And deeper we go! Uh, storage room, what can I find here in the storage room? Well, other than a nice wheelchair, that looks nice. I would love to sit down now and just, you know, nod off and go to sleep. What we got here? Uh, rocking chair, just like in any good horror store, there's always a rocking chair. Oh, interact. This shelf could be moved, but it's too heavy for me. Yeah. Yeah. All right, crouch and move. Crouch and move. That's what we got to do. Oh, great. Another message for me. At least I assume it's for me. I don't know any other reason why there would be. And almost all things are by the law purged with blood. And without shedding of blood, there is no remission. I don't know what that means, but I don't think I want to know. Okay, so we came here for a crowbar. Yay? Please stop it with the creaking door. I don't need a creaking door in my life. Hey! Well, I know you weren't there before. What are you doing over here, little missy? What are you doing over here? I'm pretty sure I didn't see you before, and there was no chair there either. <laughs> Alright, we got our crowbar. Maybe we can go to the stairs now and get the heck out of Dodge. Uh... No. No, 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 no. I'm sorry, but I, I, what, what the heck is that? Hi! Oh, dear gosh! Um... What? No. No, you just go away. Go. Go. No. Go. No. No. No light. You can see the light. You can see. Go away, please. I don't want any. Well, that was quite the welcoming, re welcoming reception. Okay, I don't know what that was. I don't know why it's there, but I am just going to continue onwards and hopefully get out of here before it comes back. Am I just following blood? Is that really all I do? Is that all I ever do? Is it... I just follow blood. I just follow blood. Oh, I don't want to go in. No, okay, that was... Oh, I really don't want to go in here. I don't, I don't, I don't. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. For the life of the flesh is in the blood, and I have given it to you upon the altar to make an atonement for your souls. Oh, dear gosh. It Jeffy. It Jeffy. Please, Jeffy, get me out of here. I want out of here. I want out of here. I don't want to be here anymore. Oh, you? Who are you? Yeah, really, who are you? Well, that seems incredibly impolite. Leave Jeff out of this. What do you know about Who is this guy? Or person? Or lady? I don't know. What? Wait, oh, I'm sorry, what now? Okay, no, no, ha, ha. Well, okay then. Well, <laughs> well, I gotta say, for a demo, this is really, really well done. Uh, um, 
I I can't really say anything other than just well done. The the pacing, the music, the the graphics were all really incredibly well done. I want to see this game become a full fledged game. I want to see this demo become a full fledged game because I have a feeling that it's going to be a spectacular game to play. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, please give me a comment in the comment section below. If you did enjoy the video, please give me a comment in the comment section below. Let's get a conversation going. I I want to hear from you guys. Seriously, I do. This is Luke Christ, and I'll catch you guys in the next game. See ya.